The difference with me, when I do what I do, when I do what I'm doing it, I do like if I'm doing it for TV. This is Jay Cruz, a.k.a. known as the Audio Cat. Another day, another video for you guys. Man, we got a lot of projects going on. This one here is one that we've already worked on before. All right, y'all, so we got Gordo over here. Working on his remote start right now, as you can tell. We got the truck coming back together again. The wheel lights did not work that the customer brought, so that could be a continued project. But we did get the top lights mounted on top of the roof, in which you'll be able to have that look going on, okay? Because that's looking actually really good and coming together, guys. We... All right, y'all, on the F-250, we're actually getting the wheel lights. Gordo's custom making these rings. You can see, if you see like an overlap, because these are custom made rings. These ain't pre-made rings. We're actually making these rings here. Gordo actually made every single ring that you see on this bad boy today that could be lighting up very shortly. It's self-manufactured here by Gordo himself. Now you see G-Rock over here, AKA known Thug Mania, AKA known as Slow Ho 5-3, and AKA known as Street Fighter. We'll find another AKA him for him very shortly because he's always got some AKA, but this one's coming together, guys, and we'll see how this rolls out in a few minutes. All right, y'all, so now we see that we got the glow, glow, glow going on on this baby girl. We got these guys wrapping it up together right now. She's flowing through all the colors. We got the underglow glowing right now. We have this over here going on right now. Look at that, look like fire. Let me walk y'all back here. It could look really good. This customer, oh, damn, who is this guy over here? Do y'all know this guy? Who is this guy? Damn, know me, I'm new, man. You knew, man, because y'all don't know him. His name is Real to Real. He's a he's the character of Real to Real, but he's I'm a clone. Guy. I thought I was a YouTuber. I guess I'm a regular worker just like you guys. No, no, no. But that's the, there's two you. you. There's Real to Real, and then there's Real to Real. There's yeah, the Real, Real to Real. They could be copy. That's my Puerto Rican name. There you right go. Now. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, we, we roll the arms. <laughs> you know, Put it real to real. Real to real. And we got these lights going on, man. Everything looking good. And we got Street Fighter down here locking this out. So we got this going, guys. And we should be all right. We're actually going to finish it. But uh, we got uh, it's completely done. We did the lighting and all the kind of stuff on it. This is one clean truck, man. Look at the American Forces on here. They're 24-inch with off-road tires. Suspension is done completely. Custom lighting. Custom everything. We have done a lot of things to this truck throughout the years. And uh, he had brought it in to do some more upgrades so today we'll be adding the train horns that scare everybody and do what we have to do it's a pretty cool thing we got our brother josh over here working right now on this uh dash kit for the infinity that he's finalizing to get it all perfect up we got jesus over there adolfo but this is the one that we're really going to be paying attention to guys this is going to have a lot of footage here because we're doing a full custom build as you can see right now this jeep is completely stock i actually put this in a while back when this truck was bought they bought this truck here in, in um, Texas, dropped it off from the dealership directly to us here in the store. We did our, our little touches to it, added some better vocals, added some bass to it. But now we're going to go full out because they just brought this Jeep back from Newark, New Jersey, guys. We got this truck coming from New Jersey. In fact, I'm going to show you the tag so y'all see. This truck just got here from Newark, New Jersey, and we got to do a full custom build, pro audio, bass, subwoofers, amplifiers, everything. Going to have almost six to seven amplifiers in this thing. It's going to be sick, y'all, but I'm going to show y'all right now. He had this installed a while back when he first got it done. He wanted something small and simple. We got those two Audio Legion 8s in there. This is completely coming out. We're doing something completely different. So you see this trunk? That's what it looked like today. I want to show y'all what this looked like today because in a few, it's not going to look nothing like that. That's the factory soundbar. You can't see in there, but I'll take it apart and show you guys. We actually got six and a half and Pro Audio tweeters in there. We custom did. And we actually did the same thing in here in the factory location. We put six and a half with customs thing too. Because so this is what the Jeep looked like today. That's not what it's going to look like. It'll be a multiple day project. We're doing fiberglass work. We're doing woodwork. We're doing a lot of fabrication. It could be a full custom build. This is going to be a lot of fun. We're going to really get into it and get it ripping apart and get it going, man. I can't really wait to get it going. It could be a lot of work, a lot of late nights, a lot of hours. But when it comes done, I know the customer is going to be happy. And we're going to be happy because we like to make our customers happy. So we'll continue the footage and let you guys um, do what you're doing. We want to thank you guys for subscribing. Thank you guys for watching our channel. Thank you guys for the support. We've actually just got monetized. I don't know if you guys know for YouTube. 240,000 minutes total work time. Also, right, we got my man Josh over here getting ready to do this train horse. What are you doing here, Josh? Explain to everybody what you're doing. What are we what are we doing right now? We're gonna drill out the hole. So Why are we drilling out a hole? It's got holes on it. Why are we doing it? So the bolt that we're gonna attach to use to attach to the Let me see the size of that bolt. Man, that's a big boat, man. So we're gonna get that boat, put it in there to make it mount up nice and solid too. Where we where's that mounted to? The the body or to the frame or the frame. to the frame? Because that could be frame mounted. I know this, y'all. 
but I'm only doing this so y'all can hear where it's going mounted. But he's making that whole round out of making frame mounted. We got AKA Jesus over here getting ready to put the compressor on to this bad boy right here to get the train horns and everything situated. We actually got the dash kit for this one. We got a mess in here, guys. Excuse the mess, but we said we got look a car apart, front ends everywhere, door panel. We have been busy, busy, busy. The guys are staying late nights and doing things. We've actually finished fiberglass in this part, which is what I came to show y'all right now. Cause this was not the way that it looked originally. Right now the paint is still drying. But if y'all look at this guys, this is perfect. I don't know if it looked the same on the camera, but this is actually very, very, very perfect. Cause this is a double din. We're making a double din dash kit. Does it come made? We made this guys. This is not something that you can just go buy. We made it to make it for this infinity right here. We max the same color inside. We actually got this built inside here. So we're installing our Nemesis 2K. He got a JL that we're going to be running for him. This is his subwoofer. You can see a wire before, but we're doing out of our... All right, y'all. So we got this one ready to go. You can see we got the underglow all the way around. We got the wheel lights going on. Everything all the way around. We got the interior glowing so he can know what's going on out there in the car. In fact, let me get my phone so I can switch this up for y'all. But right now we're going to green. We're going to blue and everything matching what he does. Look at the floorboard. That's good for you to know what's going on outside, but he got 100% all the way around, guys. He's got this going. We also put something else. When he wants to hit his horn, he's got a train horn, so he can hit a regular horn or hit a train horn whenever he wants to. Kind of the stuff that we do at AutoZone, but this is ready to get signed, sealed, and delivered to the client. We did the upgrade of the lights. Got the grill lights inside. So you got like a little glow going on. In fact, let me give you a better demo than that. Let me shut it down so you can see what is going on with this bad boy. She glowing all the way around here, man. She looking really good. In fact, we all could did those lights on the roof. You need something done, guys, I always tell you, come to AudioZone 1230 North Beltline Road. We're here to serve you. We're here to do what we have to do. AudioZone here with AudioCat doing the best that we can. I want to thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for subscribing. Y'all have a good one. God bless.